Hi, it's Laura Tomlinson here, Relationship Manager at the Unsung Hero Awards. We're back for day two of NHS Expo and what an amazing 48 hours it's been. We came here with three objectives and I feel that we've not only reached those objectives but we surpassed them on the first day. So today has just been a wonderful, relaxed way to continue to meet people and generate a really good buzz around the Unsung Hero Awards. The objectives that we had when we came here yesterday, number one was to raise the profile of the UHA to a larger audience and we've definitely done that. We've met so many individuals who work for non-medical or non-clinical or clinical medical roles within organisations, far too many for me to mention now, as well as trusts, GP surgeries, etc. They either didn't know much on the Unsung Hero Awards, but they were all keen to know and eager to know. They all left with a very positive take on what we do and who we are. And then objective number two, which leads on from objective number one, was to raise our nominations further, and that's for the 2020 awards. Well, I'm sure we've done that. Everyone that we spoke to, they all knew that one person or team of people who they would put forward for an Unsung Hero Award. And then thirdly, as we are a community interest company and we do rely on corporate sponsorship to fund the UHA, we've been spending time with our existing sponsor, Cerner. Cerner have been on board now for two years with UHA. We've been able to liaise, mingle and spend some quality time with them outside of the exposition. We've also had interest from brand new companies, so there's a lot in the works and a lot to be excited about. Remember that there's still time for you to nominate for the 2020 awards. If you wish to do so, that's via our website, unsungheroawards.com. The nominations close on the 30th of September. Best of luck.